So who are the characters? Well, our main and leading character is uh, James Green, played by Teddy McCormick, who um, is the one who's brought all the characters together. He's the one with the house, he's the one with the smarts and the will to get everything done. He knows what has to be done and how it has to be done, and knows how to get everyone to do it. He's a natural leader and knows the town pretty well, so he's easy. He's able to um, lead everybody where they need to go and stuff. He's um, he has some he has a dark past, you know, that we hint at a little bit here and there. But other than that, he's everybody pretty much likes him as he is. And uh, his right hand man is a character by the name of Doug Gresham. Um, this is played by Charlie Bear. He's a ex military family guy man. Uh, he he was never in the military, but he's he comes from a very military background. Uh, he's but he's definitely very different from his father and um, he's his motivation is a little bit different he just doesn't really care about much except for surviving on his own but he does seem to have this kind of connection with James and they share this kind of bond and uh, so he's an interesting character uh, our third and one of two female characters at the moment is Ellie Shepard who is a rather religious character um, was driven into uh, major, you know, devotion and through the um, when the virus hit and stuff, it was the only thing she could count on. And so that's basically how she's. She's very helpful, very optimistic about everything, and isn't much into the more violent aspects of what they have to do. It's kind of a contrast between uh, Ellie and James because when the outbreak hit and this and it spread, um, rather than what James did, which is pretty much abandon all thoughts of religion and just kind of wing it she she actually went the opposite way jumped she's, full head into it exactly she that's her comfort and that's how she finds any way to live in this world so our fourth character is jordan krause played by josh bk i thought it was krause sorry Krause-y. i never pronounced it that way um he's more of the comedic relief he's he doesn't really take the situation as seriously as he should, but that also helps the other characters kind of settle down time at times when they need a stress reliever. When when you say he's comedic relief, you don't mean that he's like a stupid character. Mm-mm. He's he's actually he's one of just the lighter. He has a lighter mood than most of the characters. That's one of the way he deals with all this stuff that's going on, and so it makes an interesting contrast. And then two of our more interesting characters are Adam and Cassie Monet, brother and sister of a rather rich family, who were um, who have massive supplies of warehouses and stuff, and meet the previous four characters in order to help them obtain these supplies through the warehouses and through the infected. Um, Cassie unfortunately has an illness of which could be potentially fatal if they don't find the proper medicine within this. Uh, within the supplies, and Adam is willing to do anything he can to get to it. Yeah, they share a very uh, strong family bond. Um, Adam's sole motivation is pretty much keeping his sister alive, and he'll do anything to find the cure, or anything that will keep her healthy. Um, another character, this is the uh, newcomer to the team, is Rober. His name is Roger Bertinelli, but his nickname is Rober. He's... He's uh, I, he's played by me, and uh, he's an interesting character. He's kind of cowardly. I mean, he's not a coward, but he does not. Ru- he would not rush head on into a situation. He will avoid fighting by any way possible. Um, but when faced with uh, an important decision, he can make the right one. He just doesn't like fighting. Also, as I previously forgot to mention, Adam is played by Nathan McFarlane, and Cassie is played by his sister, Caitlin McFarlane. And Ellie is played by Lauren Barr. Right, I forgot that one, too. Yes. I remember Josh, though. 